What's up guys, in this video I will show you how to install the official leaked version of the Android 4.3 for your Galaxy Note 2. So this is the official 4.3 test firmware for the Galaxy Note 2. And this is only compatible with the GTN 7100, that is the international version. So right now as you can see I have Android 4.1.2. So let's go ahead and install it. And this will not void your warranty, so it's totally safe to install this firmware. So hit link 1 from the description that will take you to this website from where you can download the 4.3 test firmware for your Note 2. So here's the download file, you can just download it. I will also be adding the mirror link in the description. And once you have downloaded it, go ahead and download the Odin, alright, from here. So make sure you have the zip file for the Android 4.3 as well as the Odin. And hit link 2 and download Samsung keys from there. So you must have PC Odin and Samsung keys installed on your PC. And here's the Android 4.3 zip file. The test firmware, alright, extract it. And you need to give in the password. So here's the password. And I will be adding the password in the description as well. Alright, okay. Okay, now that's done. On your Galaxy Note, hold the down volume, power and the home button at the same time. Keep holding it till you get into the download mode. Okay, you can let go the keys once you see this. Now go ahead and connect your phone to your PC via the USB cable. Okay, and hit the volume up to continue. And leave your phone as it is. Now, open up Odin, yes, and you must see this IDCOM tab turned into blue. If it's not blue, that means you have not installed the drivers properly, that is the Samsung keys. So guys, if you don't have this turned into blue, go ahead and try reinstalling the Samsung keys. So once you are done here, do not uh, check anything here. Now click on AP and uh, go to wherever you have extracted the zip file, alright. So here's my zip file and hit open okay and leave the rest of the settings as it is now hit start and wait for the installation to complete So once it's done, you can go ahead and unplug the phone from your PC. So we have successfully flashed the Android 4.3 here. Let me just quickly skip through the basic settings. Go ahead and check the Android version. So we have this new layout for the settings menu about device. So here's the Android 4.3 Jelly Bean. There you see. So let's quickly have a quick view on what's new, guys. Uh, here you have this new multi window, and you can move it to this side as well. All right. And uh, you have this Samsung Wallet. Play games, play magazines, what else? Nox as well. So Nox is somewhat like the guest user that you have on your Windows 7 PC. We also have this light effect lock screen from the Galaxy S4. There you see. And uh, now we can add multiple widgets on the lock screen. So that is good. Even the double finger pull down works. So that is really good. 
So guys, I guess there's a lot more than this. I will soon be doing a review on this new Android 4.3 for the Galaxy Note 2. So stay tuned. And uh, till then, you guys have a great day. Bye-bye now.